Okay, so now let's update the mesh to see what we currently have. We'll click on mesh and click update. Okay, as a quick reminder, in uh, the crank tutorial part one, we specified the mesh elements to be of size 0 0.2 inches. We specified the elements to be of type hexahedral. And we chose to refine our elements around the support hole to 0 0.1 inches. Okay, so if we um, zoom on our surface bodies, we see that they are divided into tiny, tiny little elements. And this is not what we want. We would like to have each surface body to be one element. To fix this, we'll right click on mesh, insert, sizing. We'll select the edge selection filter and select all edges by pressing down on the control button on your keyboard. and click apply. For the type here we'll select number of divisions and we see that ANSYS automatically chose the number of divisions to be one which is what we want. And the last setting to change is the behavior. Well, we'll change it to hard. Okay now update the mesh we see that our surface bodies were meshed with a single element and that the element is overlaid on top of the mesh. So that's what we want. We can save our project.